Hello readers, my name is Megan. I'm a NASA astronaut living aboard the International Space Station, and I love books. Even though we're super busy up here doing science experiments, I can always find time for stories. Today, I'm in the Japanese experiment module, and I have a story called Duck, Rabbit, by Amy Krauss Rosenthal and Tom Lichtenheld. I hope you like it. Hey, look, a duck. That's not a duck. That's a rabbit. Are you kidding me? It's totally a duck. It's for sure a rabbit. See, there's his bill. What are you talking about? Those are ears, silly. It's a duck and he's about to eat a piece of bread. It's a rabbit and he's about to eat a carrot. Wait, listen, did you hear that? I heard duck sounds, quack quack. That's funny. I distinctly heard rabbit sounds. Now, the duck is wading through a swamp. No, the rabbit is hiding in the grass. There, see, it's flying. Flying, it's hopping. Look, the duck is so hot, he's getting a drink. No, the rabbit is so hot, he's cooling off his ears. Here, look at the duck through my binoculars. Sorry, still a rabbit. Here, ducky, ducky, ducky. Here, you cute little rabbit. Oh, great, you scared him away. I didn't scare him away, you scared him away. You know, maybe you were right. Maybe it was a rabbit. Thing is, now I'm actually thinking it was a duck. Well, anyway, now what do you want to do? I don't know. What do you want to do? Hey, look, an anteater. That's no anteater. That's a Brachiosaurus. <laughs> the end. One of the things I like so much about that story is it teaches us about how even though we're looking at the same thing, we can see something a little different from others. But if we try and we change our perspective a little bit, we might be able to see things the way others do as well. We do that all the time, change our perspective here on the International Space Station. For example, right now, is this the floor? Or is it a wall? Or is it the ceiling? You decide. Bye-bye, readers.